Hello everybody, this is the one and only Janine coming at you live, fresh off of a night shift with a two hour break that did not end up working out the way it was supposed to because of a nurse that <laughs> just can't keep quiet. When she comes into a room, she reminds me of this man. <laughs> so loud so what was supposed to be a two-hour break just did not hit the way it was supposed to because naturally i would have slept it would have been, it would have been all z's the entire two hours but with her that just did not happen and she's the sweetest god bless her soul but whatever so i find that when i sleep on my break i come home and i don't sleep all day when I don't sleep on my break, I come home and I sleep all day. At this point, I'm trying to figure out which one is more important to me, which one I like, which one feels good. I have this box that I showed you guys some days ago that is still sitting in this entryway area. And it's just hair and that's just where she loves for now because I haven't really figured it out yet. And I don't know that I have any intentions of figuring it out today. So she's going to just live here for a little bit. But we're having a moment because I'm currently sitting you guys on top of her and it works. Maybe I should get a shelf on the wall there. No, no, no. Anyways, we're about to pop downstairs because I think I should have a few things downstairs. Are they saying it's delivered? Um, yesterday I bought some things. Oh, let me tell her for one of my friends off of her registry. They said one of yours. And so they said it was supposed to be, it's supposed to be delivered today. And I don't know, sometimes I think when you buy things off of registries, you can't really track it. So I wanted to make sure that I did that for her so she knows where it's at. I have the candle in the kitchen going to give the place a little oomph. I don't really know. But I'm going to go get the packages and come back. Very big. It's not heavy though. I don't really know what's inside of it, so let's get the rest and I'll tell you. Damn. I know that the neighbors across the street are somewhere always looking and judging me, wondering what the hell I be buying all the damn time. These vitamins. What is that? Aww. Oh, cute. Oh, I know what that is. Why is it smaller in person? I'll just keep a pair of scissors on standby. Especially in the entryway. All right, I'll be back. This is a little chaotic and none of the things that I'm opening, I'm showing y'all. So I'll be back. You know, I really was trying to see if I could be a productive queen and tackle the box. But that's not really working out. One, the box is big. Two, it's kind of heavy. Three, I don't have the energy. Right now it's 3.16 p.m. I've been up since 2 o'clock. I don't really know. And right now I just want to relax because everything I do, my lower back hurts, which is ridiculous. I need to get that checked out, but I'm not doing that. Hi, everyone. I just woke up earlier because I had to pee so, so bad. And so now I'm in the kitchen. This morning I came home and I just felt like, well, ever since like yesterday evening, I just felt like I have to come home and wash my hair today because like it's kind of itching and one part like was so uncomfortable and I'm just like, I can't even. So I'm coming home and I'm washing it. So I came home this morning and the first thing I did was take the U part unit off, hopped in the shower and washed my hair. I wasn't sure what, what I was going to do to it, but I ended up putting it back in a little braided ponytail like I'd normally do. So nothing new, but like I just had to. I just had to. And you know, and that's one of the things that I really worry about when it comes to like wanting to switch my hair up or like cutting my hair and stuff like that. Because I do think about it all the time and I would love to, but I really do like a bun. Like a bun just seems like the easiest thing on me and it just kind of goes sometimes and I always worry that if I cut my hair, I'm not going to be able to have that bun. That's one of the reasons why I haven't cut my hair yet. So there's that. But I'm standing in the kitchen because I thought 
I would have just gone back to sleep naturally, but I don't feel like I have to sleep, which is so annoying. So now we're here. When I have to sleep, I don't like drinking too much water because when I do that, I constantly have to get up to pee. But I'm so thirsty all the time too. So at this point, I don't even know. The weirdest thing just happened to me. I did go on my Walgreens thing and I had a prescription. And so I went on there and said that I wanted it delivered, which is something that I always do because I'm lazy and I don't want to walk out there. So I went on there and I said I wanted to have it delivered. But when I did it was also when I was damn near about to fall asleep and was not in the mood to do it. But I knew that the medication was ready. And so somebody just called me and said they're from DoorDash. And it happened a couple of days ago. And I'm just like, mm, who is this? I'm not answering because I didn't order anything. So when they called me and I seen DoorDash come up, I'm like, well, I did say I wanted delivery. So I answered and the man was like, hello. So I'm like, yeah. And he's like, Walgreens. He said pharmacy deliveries. I'm like, all right, let me go downstairs. But I brought my pepper spray with me downstairs because I just feel like, I don't know, and I'm not sure, and you're not going to kidnap me because I'm going to pepper spray you at the door, and that's just where we're going to be at. And it's crazy that in 2023, we have to think like that. So I went down there, and sure enough, it was really my meds from Walgreens. And I'm like, oh, okay. But I was definitely standing behind the door because with my pepper spray ready, because I just feel like... Um, too many things are going on in the world right now. But also the other day when I requested delivery, I can't remember um, having ordered anything. So I don't really know. But now that I know that that's a thing that Walgreens does, I guess if I see them calling again when I've ordered something, I'll answer because that may just be them coming to deliver it. But that was so odd for me. <laughs> Hi, y'all. I think I kind of messed with the settings on this camera yesterday and now I don't know. No, I don't know. I gotta see. But, um, let's back up some. Right now I'm in the kitchen. And yesterday we went to, my friend and I went to this store and she bought some meat that she wanted me to cook for her. So I'm going to make that right now. Because she asked me about it this morning. And while I'm not in the mood, I'm going to, I'm going to make it. Oh, I hate cooking when I'm not in the mood because it doesn't come out the way how I want to, but I'm just feeling lazy. It's not that I'm, I don't really know. <laughs> Honestly, I don't really know. Last night was not my, my best night. I wasn't really feeling too good, but I feel better today. I'm wearing this overseas shirt. Hopefully y'all don't see my panties. I'm wearing this oversized shirt. Well, it's not an oversized shirt. It's not my shirt. It's his shirt. And so, it's oversized. So, um, yeah. I'm going to make the chicken. I'm going to sit at the table here. Because I'm trying to upload some videos for you guys. Like, the last set of pregnancy content. Before baby gets here. Um, <laughs> y'all know that TikTok that says, You shut up! I'm so... You shut up! I'm so scared right now, you shut up! Are you doing this? No, I'm doing this! I'm so nervous right now, you shut up! Me, right now. Especially considering the fact that last night I was not feeling my brightest. But, um, you know, we're here. And I'm okay, I think. So we're gonna make the food. Um, sit here and, and upload some videos. Yes, yes, that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. So I'll see you guys later or whenever. I don't really know, honestly.